welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to use alerts and reminders in smartsheet let's begin now the first thing you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time in smartsheet you can continue using your google account your microsoft account you can even use your Apple account and by following the on-screen instructions, you're good to go. Now, using alerts and reminders in Smartsheet offers a lot of benefits because it can help you stay on top of deadlines by notifying you when tasks or milestones are approaching or overdue. Now, this ensures that important dates are not missed and allows you to take time a timely action to keep projects on track because for one, Alerts and reminders allow you to prioritize tasks by highlighting urgent or critical items that require immediate attention. And by receiving notifications for high-priority tasks, you can focus on your efforts on the most important activities and ensure they are completed on time. Now, for us to trigger alerts and reminders here in Smartsheet, just go to the left-hand panel of your dashboard and click on Create New click on the uh, create sheet and from here just wait for a little bit it'll load up and once you've done that now essentially now once we are here maybe let's put some information for now okay and for you to be able to use the um, alerts and reminders all you have to do is go to the left upper left corner on automation and from here you can click on the plus button because when you do that what will happen is as you can see you can alert someone for when a specified criteria are met you can remind someone on a specific date you can even move a row to another sheet when specified criteria are met all right now i'm gonna use the notifications and reminders i am going to alert someone when specified criteria are met i'll click on this one as you can see, these are the great ways to use this template and how to use it so you are not going to be lost during the whole navigation process because it's a straightforward, it's very easy to follow and just click on the use template. And for as you can see, you can rename this specific um, workflow template. You can trigger. You have the option when a date is reached, when rows are added or changed, when rows are changed, when rows are added. So it's up to you. Now, when the when field is going to be in this specific column, column 2, column 3, until column 6. And the changes, it's up to you. Now, for the triggered workflow, when triggered, is it going to be hourly, daily, and weekly? So, it's up to you for the customization. You can also add a condition right here. That means, say for example, you can select a field. You can alert someone. You can even change action and send to a specific people say for example send to a specific people send to contacts in a cell say for example you're gonna send this trigger alerts and reminders to your boss to your client to your uh, specific teammate to your organization and a lot you can customize the message right here you can even put a uh, subject and obviously from here all you have to do is just click on save but of course, you need to add an email if you wanted. And after that, what will happen is it will help you manage deadlines, prioritize tasks, enhance communication, leading to improved project management and better overall productivity. Thank you so much for watching and we will see you in the next one.